What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are doing a makeup video, finally. Yeah, let's just go ahead and jump into it. I'm going to start off, oh, hold on y'all, I'm trying to watch, watch the children. I'm gonna go ahead and prime my face. This is the Iconic London Underglow Blurring Primer. What is he doing? Oh my gosh. So I'm gonna go ahead and prime my face with this. Oh. I want to be super glowy, super glowy, super like just warm and yeah, just giving all the summer vibes, I guess. Primer is on. I'm going to go ahead and do my brows. Um, I'm going to do them off camera as usual. I will film a brow tutorial at some point, but not today. So just one second. Brows are on. Okay. For shadow. We are going in back in with our culture palette. We're going in with this row today. So we want all of the warmth that we have in this row. I'm going to grab a fluffy brush and I'm just gonna take this orange shade here and I'm gonna apply that <clears throat> all over my eye sorry y'all i got this little mirror right here so that i can see because my camera is like in the way of my big mirror so i'm just gonna use this little mirror but i'm just gonna apply that like all over or in my crease but just blending it everywhere but yeah i'm just blending this all over and almost like up to my brow okay almost right up to my brow and bringing it out a little bit to the side okay and i'm just gonna build that until it's as orange as i want it to be so i forgot to prep me lips so I'm just putting on some, what is this? The Too Faced Hangover Pillow Balm. Now I'm gonna go in with this color right underneath it on like a smaller blending brush. And I'm just gonna kind of put that in my crease area. This is like almost a yellow orange. But I'm gonna pop that right in my crease. I don't know if y'all can see. I don't even know if it's making a difference, but we doing it. Cause then we're gonna go in with the brown in a second. So I'm just gonna throw this in here. Now I'm gonna take like a small fluffy brush. And we're gonna take this brown color here and basically do the same thing and put it right into the crease. So I just put that into my crease. You can see this is not like a super complicated look i'm just gonna go back in with that brush that i just used for that lighter color and i'm just gonna kind of blend the edges of that a little bit all right so this is what we have right now and then i'm gonna go in with like a flat shader brush and we're gonna take the gold shade and pop that out in the lid <clears throat> and i'm just gonna put that like right in the middle where i didn't really do anything so kind of all over the lid just like where i left it blank we just gonna pop that on right there This is what we have so far. I think I'm just gonna leave it like this for right now. 
and we'll move on to the face until I decide what I'm gonna do. We already primed our face, so let's just go in with our foundation. I'm gonna use the MAC Studio Radiant Radiance Studio Radiance Face and Body Foundation. So this was the MAC Face and Body. Um, but I guess it's like dang, that was a lot. I guess they reformulated it. I don't know, but now it's Studio Radiance Face and Body. That was so much. It's running down my face. So I'm just gonna apply that to my face. And like I said, I wanted to be glowy today. So I'm choosing a radiant um, foundation. But this foundation is lightweight and it's not full coverage so it's nice it's just a sheer sheer and glowy foundation so you can see you can see that glow that's what we want today that's what we want i'm gonna go in with my concealer today i'm using the lancome tint edel ultra wear concealer yeah, I'm just gonna put this here. And you can see this is not like super bright, but we will go in and brighten in a bit. I'm gonna apply this just kinda in the normal spots, but I'm not gonna put it in the spots that I like wanna brighten up because I'm gonna use a different concealer for that. So I'm going to put that on. I'm going to let that sit for a minute. <clears throat> I'm going to go in with my Mario contour stick on my face. Look, look, now it takes me to get mad. Baby, I cannot finish a face without somebody okay like i cannot yeah now she's mad she's standing at like the entrance of the gate i mean yeah the entrance of the playpen like where it opens she's standing there like somebody get me out of here like listen i'm trying to do this makeup y'all y'all are not letting me y'all are not letting me be great right now I'm gonna blend this concealer out real quick and then I gotta go get her. So y'all can see like that does not brighten or anything. It's pretty close to my skin tone, which I do like. And it's nice for like every day when you don't want an ultra bright look. It looks nice. I'm going to take this Too Faced Born This Way Concealer. This is in the shade Cookie, and this is bright. So I'm just going to put a little dot. I see how bright that is. I'm just putting a little, just a tiny bit of this concealer where I want to brighten. And I'm not going to let this one sit for too long just because I got to go get the child. But I'm going to go ahead and blend that out. So we can have a little bit of brightness. And I'll come back and contour my nose after the child. Let me make sure that Boogaloo is still asleep. Okay, and then yeah, we're just gonna blend that out a little bit. We just want a little brightness. Not too much. I don't even know if y'all can tell, but we're just adding a little brightness. Just a smidge. I'm gonna take my Huda Beauty Easy Bake Powder. This is in the shade Blondie. 
And then I'm just gonna press it underneath my eye. All right, me. I don't wanna get powder everywhere because I'm still going in with, um, I'm still gonna go in with some cream products once I get back. But I can't, I can't not set my concealer under the eyes, so. Boom, okay. I'm gonna leave this here for now and go put the other child to sleep and then I'll be back. Okay, twin number two, down for a nap. Next, I'm gonna go in with a cream blush. This is from Tower 28. This is in the shade Power Hour. So I'm just gonna take some cream blush right onto my cheeks. Now I need to contour my nose. So I'm just taking that Mario and putting it on a little contour brush and I'm just gonna contour my nose real quick, real quick. I'm terrible at contouring my nose by the way, but I be trying. I'll be trying. Okay. Let's do the tip of the nose. Yeah. And we'll do a little line right here to give us a little bit of a button. That's a big button. I made that line too high. Whatever, man. <clears throat> it's fine, I suppose. Now I wanna go ahead and powder the rest of my face. Um, since I'm going to do that cream highlighter last, so I'm going to take my Dior powder and a big powder brush and just powder the rest of my face. And you can see that blush gives us a little bit of a glow too, which is nice for what we want, but we're going to set everything down here, okay? Setting the rest of the face. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. -mm -mm -mm. Now I can go in and add my powder products. So I'm gonna start with my bronzer. This is the Charlotte Tilbury bronzer in the shade three. There's like a hair. I mean, there's hair like dangling in my ears. Um, and I just feel like this bronzer like makes me the bronziest of bronze. Like out of all my bronzers, I feel like this is like the bronziest. Like when I really wanna be bronze, this is the bronzer that I grab. Then we're gonna go in with the Jaclyn Cosmetics Rouge Romance Palette for our blush. I'm kind of feeling fancy pants or tempting. Mm, or this one. Ever after. I don't know. Maybe we'll just, you know, we'll do a little cocktail. We just, I just mixed those three shades. Yeah, so I just mixed three blushes together. And I'm just going on top of that cream blush that I applied. Okay, now we're gonna go in, here we go, with cream, cream highlighter. I'm taking the Vive Skin Dew. This is like glowy, 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 glowy. Ooh, look at that. Like, can y'all even see? Like, look at that, it's everywhere. So I'm just gonna take this on the palm of my hand. I didn't even, oh, oh my God, that was so much. Ooh, listen, I don't need all that. Oh my God, it's literally coming out everywhere. What happened? Look at this. Like, you don't need this much, okay? You do not need this much. So I'm just taking some and I'm actually just gonna kind of run it over my hand because it's too much, but then I'm gonna apply it to my cheeks oh look at that it's so pretty it's so pretty look at that glow can y'all see that it's so pretty i'm gonna take some on my nose <coughs> i'm just taking some on the tip of my nose and on the bridge of my nose, like that. We're gonna go in with a 
powder highlighter next, okay? So I'm gonna take this um, Danessa Myricks Light Work Palette. I think we're gonna go in with this color here, Common Sense. I'm gonna go in with this, with this color and I'm just gonna put that, oh my God, I'm gonna put that on top. Hey, listen, okay, that might be a lot. That's a lot, like, <laughs> That's too much. That's way too much highlighter, y'all, okay? It's too much. It's too much. We're gonna have to bring it down. I'm gonna try to bring that down. We're gonna try to bring it down the, as best we can. So I'm picking my powder brush that I used earlier to set my whole face. And yeah, we had, we had to bring that down. Like, that was, that was a lot. I feel like the face is about done. We just need to finish the eyes. So let's get back into our culture palette. I'm gonna take that brown, <clears throat> same brown and the same brush and I'm gonna run it on, on my lower lash line. Then I'm gonna take that highlighter that I used on my cheeks from the Danessa Marks palette and I'm gonna put it in my inner corner. Oh, hello. Because I'm in her corner. I think we're going to add a little bit more dimension here, though. I think we need, <clears throat> I think we need a little, a little shine some. I mean, this is cute for just like basic, you know, soft like day makeup. But I'm going to take this MAC Eye Cold. This is in the shade Teddy. I'm just gonna put that in my waterline. Now I wanna add like a brown to my, um, my, my lid. I wanna add a brown my lid. I'm going to take this Viseart palette and I'm just going to take this dark brown shade and I'm going to like smudge that onto my lid. I'm going to take a tiny little pencil brush and like blend this, blend this out. I'm going to go ahead and pop a lash on. Your girl's gonna put a lash on today, okay? Lashes that I'm going to apply are by Kiss. They are so, the so real. What the hell? What I was labeled? The so real lashes. I'm gonna apply these. Okay. My eyes are watering. We are just about finished. Um, let's go ahead and move on to the lip. I'm gonna apply, this is Makeup Forever Limitless Brown. I'm just gonna go straight in with a gloss because I don't feel like wearing lipstick. This is Tower 28 Lip Gloss in this shade Cashew, which I haven't worn this in a while, so. Hopefully it looks decent with this lip liner. Is it giving bronze? Now I'm just gonna go ahead and set my face. Oh, I'm using my Morphe setting spray. And I'm actually gonna go in with a second setting spray. I'm gonna use the um, Patrick Tosh, She's Thirsty. Is that what it's called? She's Thirsty Major Glow Dewy Milk Mist. I'm gonna use this. Just to help give us, give us some more glow. This is the final look, you guys. I hope y'all can see. Okay, I feel like I'm like far away. Let me see. Let me see. 
and I can't like zoom in on this setting. So I hope everybody can see, but this is the final look, okay? Glowy, warm eyeshadow, nothing too crazy, just nice glowy bronze. Are we bronze enough? Do we need more bronzer? I hope you all enjoyed this very chaotic real life mom stuff video, okay? And I will see you guys in the next makeup video. Hopefully, you know, I can get just back into the habit of filming these kind of videos for you guys because this is really why I started my channel was for makeup videos. So yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.